What's up, Anartax? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're back playing on X Life, and uh, I might die today. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Lizzie made basically a death parkour near spawn. So um, we're gonna try it later because if we can complete it, there's the cutest hecking little pig trophy plushy looking thing ever. And uh, well, I want it. I'm pretty sure everyone that has tried this has died. So my chances are very small, but I'm going into this with some positive vibes because either I go in, I win and I get the trophy or I go in, I die, but I leave with pink hearts instead of the orange ones. Besides attempting the death parkour, I want to show you guys what we did on stream. If you remember in the previous episode where I built all of those YouTuber statues, I didn't include the new members because I didn't know where they lived. But on stream, we went around, we found their waystones, and we made the new members some cute statues. Oh, and also, everyone was telling me that since I built everyone else's statue, that I should have one too. And if we go right over here and look at the top of this mountain <gasps> there I am with a little sheep on my head I even made my backpack that's on my back so it's like kind of realistic look see we have matching backpacks and something else that we did was we built this bridge to uh, connect this because if people want to come to sheep land they would have to like go through this and it was kind of annoying so we made this cute little bridge that way it's easier for people to get from my waystone to the theme park and you know what while I'm here I might as well check to see if we got any more diamonds I don't think we're gonna get any more I don't know if anyone else is gonna come visit I feel like this has been out for a while now and everyone that would have visited probably did already let's go ahead and check this chest dang it ah no months okay wait what about my gift shop is there anything by the Jeb hello Nope. Okay. Well, the park is officially dead. Sad times. But it's okay. Wait, guys, guess what? While I was on stream, I checked my crystal shop and someone bought out all of my crystals. Like literally all of them. I had to put out a sign that says we're currently sold out. Look at this. Everything is empty. And you know what? Guess who bought everything? It was Joey. Our shops are finally at peace. Whoa, wait a minute. I'm getting low on warp scrolls. Hold on, we have to go back home. Hopefully Joel has a bunch in his shop that I can buy. Let me just quickly grab some diamonds. Oh, and I saw this sign on stream the other day, uh, right outside of my waystone. This says, come see my house. I just redecorated, love Mika, which is interesting. So on stream, I went to go visit and, uh, well, I'll just show you what I saw. So yeah, someone put a giant poop on her house. It's beautiful, I love it. But also, I just saw that there's a sign on my notice board for Jimmy Buck's coffee. Coffees which make life more exciting. Let's head on over to Spawn to see if we can buy some more warp scrolls. Then I'm gonna show you guys the statues that I made on stream and then we can visit Jimmy Bucks. All right, let's see Mr. Bobs and Bits. Do you have any warp scrolls today? Warp scrolls. Oh, yes, he still has some. Let's take two stacks. And now let's go to Quig's place first. All right, so if we go outside of his little dirt hole thing, I built his statue right over here. Look at it. But yeah, so this is Quig's statue. Next, we'll go to H's house. Um, And I will just let you know right now, this one is, is not the best. In the previous episode, remember how I said Flips was weird looking? Well, this one might be a little weirder. Um, So if we just fly right on top of this mountain, like his waystone is right there. I put it directly above him. I don't know if he'll ever see this, but um, <laughs> here it is. <laughs> Look at his face. It's so bad. It's, I just, mm. listen, when I say I tried, I promise you, I tried. He has like facial hair on his skin and it, I just, uh, I'm sorry. Kind of looks like you got a booty hole in your face. I'm sorry. <laughs> so even though that one is, you know, a little bit questionable, Gems is actually really cute. So let's go there next. Oh, people are leaving welcome gifts. Oh, shoot. I should have, actually, 
My statue counts as a welcome gift, you're welcome. <laughs> but so here is her little starter house. I built her statue right behind in the water, right over this way. Look how cute this is. Hers is adorable. I just, I really like her skin in general. So this one was really fun to build. Well, now that I've shown you all the statues and things that we did on stream, I want to address some of the comments on my previous video. I did not make a statue for Jack, only because Joel was gonna build him one. I don't know if he did it yet or not, but I saw a lot of comments that said that I should make him one anyway because my style is different than Joel's. And honestly, I have to agree with you. I think he would like a little kawaii statue too. So let's visit Jack's place real quick. Jack's area is so different from the last time I was here. <gasps> Whoa, wait, this is what Flip built for him, right? Wait, I want one of these. I want this exact castle in different colors. This is adorable. What the heck? This castle is sick. It's like a mushroom castle. I want a castle. Guys, I want a castle. I want a castle right now. All right. Well, now that we're here, where can we put a statue? That mountain back there looks pretty good. We're building it right here. It's gonna go right behind his beanstalk. Alright guys, so here's Jack's statue. I think it looks pretty cute. He's a little mushroom boy. Aw, guys, look at him up there. That's a good spot. Well, now that Jack's statue is done, let's head on over to Spawn to check out Jimmy Bucks. Oh my god, Quig just died. I think he was doing the parkour. Guys, if Quig died, I have no chance. Oh no. All right, well, let's see. I think Jimmy Bucks is over this way. Oh, and also this is a thing now. The Seven Heart Clubhouse is here. But if we keep going this way, we're at Jimmy Bucks. Oh guys, this is like a cute little coffee place. I'm gonna buy all the coffee. Okay, so what's inside? We have a little menu. Jimmy Bucks coffee, frappuccino, iced coffee, Americano, and a mocha. All oh, coffees cost three diamonds. Dang, dude. Look at that little coffee machine. Wait, what's over here? There's like balcony outdoor seating. This, oh, this is so cute. I want to buy some coffee. Whoa, oh my God, wait, these are so cute. Oh my God, wait, I want one of each. Wait, look at this coffee in my hand. Oh my God, hold on, we have to go home. Jimmy, you have a beautiful store, I love it. These are going right in my kitchen. Oh, stop it. Oh my God. Oh, these are the cutest little drinks. Okay. Well, now that we have our cute coffees, it's uh, it's time to go try the parkour. Oh God, why are the fish out of the, oh, th mm. okay. Well, that, yep. Was that foreshadowing my death? Is that, am I the fish? Oh God. All right, so let's see the rule book. Please read carefully. How to play. Complete as many stages of the parkour as you can in one run. If you fall, you may start again from the very beginning if you want. You will receive a prize for each stage of the parkour you complete. Video evidence is required. Oh, and there's a lot of rules of no's. No, 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 no. Wow, okay, if you fall, you die. Great. Okay, before I do this, like I was saying before, literally, I think almost everyone that has tried this has died. Joel has died. Scott has died. H has died, Quig has died, Whip died, Jimmy died, and I think it's my turn. Because you see this course, it looks innocent, it looks nice, it looks safe. And then you look up, and that's where you'll die. Honestly, not gonna lie, I feel like I <laughs> might not even make it up that high, uh, but we'll see. If I live, I get a cute trophy, and if I die, I get to get rid of my disgusting orange hearts, and I get pink ones instead, so it's, uh, kind of a win-win. All right, enough stalling. Let's get rid of our items and see how far we can get. We're going up, we're going up. Oh. Oh. Okay, we did it. Congratulations, you completed the baby mode stage. The prize is one diamond. All right, stage two, froggy stage. Uh, we have some stairs. Oh God. Oh. <gasps> I need someone to hold my hand. Why is this block so much farther than the other ones? Oh. Uh. No! I forgot 
to press sprint. Oh my God, but wait, look at my hearts. Oh, they're pink. Oh, they're so cute. I never want to die again. These hearts are precious. <gasps> we cannot lose the pink hearts. Absolutely not. These are so cute. Oh. Okay, well, that makes me happy. But what doesn't make me happy is that my stupid pinky finger did not press the button to run. So, uh, well, that's my bad. Okay, well, I want to put my armor back on because I feel naked. That is much better. <gasps> I just realized I just lost my four heart club bedroom. That was a really cute spot in the tree house. But speaking of clubhouses, let's go check out the five heart clubhouse. Oh, that's right. There's a rainbow road leading to it. Oh, this is adorable. We have a beautiful pink castle for our clubhouse now. Excuse me, how do I get inside building? Hello? Oh, stairs. That would make sense. Oh wait, there's slime here. This is a bouncy castle with a roller coaster. There's no bedrooms though. Wait a minute, I'll be right back. Okay, I have returned because we need to do a little bit of redecorating. There are no bedrooms or anything in this house. Where am I gonna sleep? Okay, so I like the idea of this place. Um, the bouncy house stuff, it's really cute. Uh, I just, mm, I think it's a little bit dangerous and honestly the rails and the torches kind of look a little ugly. So I think I might get rid of them and just like pop them in a chest if I don't know, maybe someone in the future wants to use it. But for now, I think these gotta go. Okay, this already looks a thousand times better. Clutter free, we love that. Um, But I did put everything in this chest over here in the corner. So if anybody wants to make any of this stuff again, they can. But now if you look at my inventory, I have quite a bit of pink items that I wanna use. So along this back wall, I wanna add a headboard for my bed. Then because this build is even and not odd, I can actually place down two beds to make a big bed. Then we can surround it by slabs just to make it look a little bit neater. Then I was thinking on either side, we can add two of these counters so that they look like little nightstand tables. On one nightstand table, I wanna add a pink little flower in a flower pot. And then on the other, I know this is technically purple, but um, it's cute and I want it. We have a little mushroom lamp. Now we can just add my sheep plushie back here. And I found these cute pink pixel hearts that we can put along the back. Wait a minute, I can't fit both here. Give me my sheep. We'll put that there. And instead, we'll put my sheep over here. Now let's just go ahead and add some pink fairy lights above my bed. And to make this look like a fuzzy carpet, I'm gonna put some of the pink leaves on top. So if we just go like this, it looks like an actual fuzzy carpet now. All right, guys, well, I think I'm done remodeling the clubhouse. Let me know what you think about my cute little bedroom setup in the comments below. But with that, I think that's gonna be it for today's video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll see you next time. Bye.